Ableton Live 12.3 is here and it finally delivers some of the most requested features. And one of them, total surprise. It goes beyond what most DAWs offer and it solves one of the biggest workflow headaches in music production. Hey, I'm Craig, and in this video, I'm gonna break down three of the most important features in Ableton Live 12.3. First up is stem separation. You can now split any sample into four individual tracks, vocals, drums, bass, and other. Just right click on the sample, scroll down to separate stems to new audio tracks. Click. You can individually select which ones you want and then press separate. Ableton then creates a new group with each stem on a new track. But is it perfect? Mm, not always. Let's have a listen. So I'm going to solo up the vocals here and have a listen. Oh, why don't you let me know? Done an amazing job there. Really good quality. It's even got the reverb and echo. Good job, Ableton. Now things go a little bit wrong in my drum stem. Check this out. Quite a lot of digital artifacts and also it's got some of the synth in it as well if you listen to the other that's where things really aren't that great just yet if you listen it's got a lot of digital artifacts so that's not great but the vocals are really really good and it's fast it's local and it opens up a ton of new sampling possibilities and on that topic the next new update is Splice integration. Splice is now fully integrated into Live's browser, which makes it super easy to search for samples without switching between tabs. And the best bit is you can preview your samples in sync with your track. And this doesn't eat into your credits. Let's see that in action here. So if I press play on this acapella I just created with the stem separation, oh, I can instantly preview stuff in time. Nice. When I'm happy, just drag it in. Yeah, you know I'll be ready, be ready. Oh, why don't you find a drum? Hey, drag that in. Yeah, you know I'll be ready, be ready. Loop it out. Let me go in, add in a few more, and let's see what I come up with. So here we go, let's hear what I've come up with. It's so quick and simple. And yes, it works with the free Splice account. So that's over 2000 new samples directly in sync in your Ableton Live browser. You have lots of search options here, instruments, genres, cinematic effects. This one here is really cool. We can simply grab a loop, drag it in here, and Splice does the hard work for you. Its AI is going to search through all its library find samples that it thinks will fit with the sample you dragged in. Next up is something that's been in other DAWs for years and we finally have it and that is bounce to groups. All we need to do is create a group by highlighting all the tracks, pressing Command G, Control G in Windows. We highlight what section of the group we'd like to bounce. We right click, we go either bounce group in place, which will replace the group with just a track or we can go bounce group to new track. So quick, so good. Let's hear that group. Such a welcomed new feature. And that's it. Stem separation, splice integration, and bounce to groups. Ableton Live 12.3 goes above and beyond. And to be honest, it's a game changer for sampling within Ableton Live.
Let me know in the comments below which one you're most excited to play with. And if you'd like more exclusive production tricks and tips like this, sign up to my newsletter, The Weekly Push. Get one trick, one quote, and one Max for Live device recommendation directly to your inbox every Tuesday. Link is in the description below. Anyway, I've been Craig. Bye for now. See you in the next one.